This is Luke O'Neill after Dorking 1, uh, Ebsleet 4. Great scoreline and a great game for everybody. Yeah, no, we're delighted. You know, um, we put a shift in today and we knew it was going to be a tough battle. Um, you know, we, we conceded the goal, which nine times out of ten, we just clear it. Um, we stuck together and stuck to the game plan and um, it paid off. It showed a lot of character, didn't it? Coming back from the, the, the goal, it was a setback. I mean, this is a very unlucky ground for Ebsley. You know, I don't think you've won here before today. But to come back in the way you did, it was emphatic, wasn't it? Yeah, no, it was brilliant. Um, I've heard of, obviously, the, um, the the games here before, like, not been successful. Uh, it's my first time playing here, and um, I thoroughly enjoyed it. Uh, we've just got to keep going and, and just look after ourselves. And the quality of the goals scored by the side this afternoon were, were, were exceptional, and, and yours. Talk us through the <laughs> talk us through the free kick. Was there ever any doubt that you were going to take it? No, no. I I felt um, I felt like I was going to score. I had a conversation with Rax, and I said to him, "I'm going to score this." And you know, it paid off, and it and it went in the in the far corner. And that was just before half time, which was a fairly crucial time to to, to get ahead. I mean, to go in at half time with a lead that was a big big feature for the fleet. Yeah, no, definitely. We were we were confident off that, and we knew we could kick on, uh, especially going into the second half. We knew we'd soak up some pressure. Um, we did first probably first ten fifteen minutes, and I thought we defended brilliantly as a team, um, every single one of us. And then, uh, like I say, said before, it, it paid off, and we and we got our goals. This was uh, another exceptional result in, since Danny Searle's come in. Uh, I mean, how has he tweaked it? How, how has he made things improve so dramatically as they have done? I just think he's given us that confidence to go out there and, and just believe in yourself, really. Um, and, you know, we've we've worked hard on the training pitch and, and you can see it's paying off on the uh, on the weekends and Tuesday nights. You, you, you're seeing the, the, the form uh, in, in, in the side improving week in, week out, it, it, and you're zooming up the form guide, and, and people are going to wonder how you, you, you got so low in the first place. But from now till the end of the season, you must be looking forward very optimistically. Yeah, no, we're looking forward now to to each game. Um, you know, we're we're on a good we're on a good run, and we don't want to um, sit on our laurels and and just sit back. We want to kick on and, and and do as well as we can. On Tuesday night against Woking, it was a one 0 win. It was a scrappy game. It wasn't the best quality of, of game, but today the performance across the ninety minutes was was outstanding. It was it was really the the benchmark where you want to be, wasn't it? Yeah, for sure. You you know, Tuesday night was it was an ugly game, but sometimes they're, they're the better wins you know because uh, a lot of teams go under and we've done brilliant Tuesday and, we, and like I said we come here today and dug deep and, and we've got four brilliant goals Any doubt you're going to stay up? Oh, we all believe in that change room so um, I've, yeah, I've, I believe we'll stay up yeah. Well let's hope you do fantastic goal it was a joy to watch and a great team performance well done this yeah, afternoon Thank you